Hi there, I'm John with TechNection in the US and today I'm going to spend a few minutes talking to you about another product we have coming out from TechNection called Axon. Axon is a new system on module we have coming out. It's a small form factor module and what's special about Axon is that on this product we actually put a field programmable gate array, an FPGA, a piece of programmable logic that's very useful for um, being able to do a lot of different kinds of I.O. switching between the SOC and the baseboard, as well as adding additional peripherals or adding even custom logic. Uh, so with Axon, it's a small form factor module. It's a 37 by 58 millimeters, so it's a pretty small form factor product. On this particular version, we have two different versions coming out with Axon initially. This has the NXP IMX Ada Mini Quad Core Cortex A53 at 1.8 gigahertz. Um, it has up to four gigabytes of LPDDR4. It has, over here, it has our Pixie 9377 wireless, which is uh, one by one, 802.11 AC, plus Bluetooth 5, fully certified in the US, Europe, Canada, Japan, and Australia, New Zealand. Um, we have power management here, as well as on the back side. Uh, again, we have the FPGA. We have our board to board expansion connectors, and then we have uh, our EMMC up to, I think it's even 64 gigabytes now, uh, or even 128 gigabytes of EMMC. And then we have uh, our Gigabit Ethernet Fi. So um, this is Axon IMX 8M Mini coming soon from TechNection. Um, we also have another one, Axon IMX 6. Axon IMX 6 is a little special because IMX 6 has so many display interfaces coming out of it. It has uh, up to 24 bits of parallel TTL display interface. It has two LVDS channels. It has MIPI DSi, it has HDMI. So on Axon MX6, we still have the same FPGA, but we have four connectors here, suitable for, connect for connecting to the baseboard. Um, we have up to four cores of uh, Cortex A9 processor, uh, memory, uh, same wireless module, um, power management, and the rest. So all the same functionality on both modules. They're both pin, can pin, pin for pin compatible. So you can plug them onto the same baseboard. They both work very well. Um, for Axon, we have uh, what we call Axon Pi. Axon Pi is a Pi form factor baseboard. Um, so same form factor as Raspberry Pi. On the back side of the board, we have the Axon module. We have a micro SD card interface. We have a click slot, which is great for connecting um, sensors. We have various sensors and wireless modules that are available for clicks. Uh, if I turn that over and look at the top side of the board, you can see all the rest of the capabilities we have. We have 40 pin expansion connection. We have our voice connection here for connecting voice hats. We have a micro USB and what we put here is a, a USB to serial adapter on the board itself. So you can get console access without having to do any sort of USB or any sort of serial adaptation um, yourself uh, using an external USB to UART. Uh, port. Um, we have a MIPI CSI2 connector here for connecting cameras. We have USB Type-C for powering the board and loading the product and, and can be also used as a USB OTG cable or USB OTG connection. We have HDMI. We have audio. Uh, so we have a, a codec on the board uh, that has, we have a line, or, or sorry, a microphone and, and headphones uh, as well as speakers. Um, we have a USB switch here. Uh, we have our MIPI DSi uh, connections here for talking to our 5-inch MIPI DSi uh, uh, display. And we even have a little JTAG connector here for, uh, for debugging the Cortex-M4 uh, on, on the board or even the Cortex-A53 uh, if you need to do that. So this is Axon Pi for evaluating our Axon, um, our Axon modules. Uh, we will also have another form factor board coming around Axon called Axon Wizard, uh, which is uh, our mini ITX form factor uh, boards, and it'll be even more breakout of, of connections uh, from, from, the, uh, from the Axon uh, SOMs. Stay tuned for more information on Axon, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more technical information and videos regarding TechNection products.